Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Sagittarius. This is going to be for your October 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. So um, we are going to take a look at the person that you are dealing with, thinking of separated from. We're going to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situations, switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels. Um, uh, support me on there too. That's, uh, the links for those are in the description box below. Anyone interested in booking a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So Sagittarius, what messages do we have for Sagittarius in love? You can apply this to new love, current love, or an ex regarding the situation here. Tell me what the person that Sagittarius is dealing with, thinking of, separated from. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Sagittarius? Towards Sagittarius here. So we have the Knight of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, and also the Temperance card, Sagittarius energy. Strong Sag. Some of you guys could be dealing with another Sagittarius. Okay, this person's true feelings and intentions. Let's see here, we have the Ace of Wands here and the Six of Wands. You know, to be quite honest here, you know, I don't feel like this person's looking for anything serious at this time. You know, they're looking to have fun with you, leave come back to have fun, more fun here. You know, I, 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 I feel like, you know, over time, this person's going to realize that, you know, you are their wish fulfillment, okay? Over time, they're going to realize that they're going to fall in love with you. They're, they're basically going from a playboy, playgirl here, you know, who's in it for the passion, who's in it for the sex, you know, and, and I feel like it's going to turn into something more with the Ace of Cups here. Okay, but you know, I do feel like this person's definitely gonna feel bad at some point here. Okay, uh, because I feel like this person feels bad because they're gonna be caught in a rock in a hard place. You know, does this person still want to continue to be in this energy of just non committal, or do they want to be with you here? Okay, so I do feel like this person's gonna struggle with this. What else do we have for Sagittarius? Tell me this Knight of Wands here. Why is this Knight of Wands here for Sag? Ace of Wands, double Ace of Wands here. This person's in it for the sexy time. And let me just say that this person's really, really, really good in bed. Like, I feel like this person has some moves, okay? This person just wants to bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk, okay? That's all this person wants, okay? Seems like this person might be a bit of a sex machine here with the Three of Pentacles here and Temperance. Sagittarius energy. Sagittarius energy, I'm so sorry. This is like Capricorn energy. Interestingly enough, you know, I feel like this person is just really kinky here. I feel like this person is like someone here who wants a three-way here too. Yeah, Knight of Wands again. This person's only in, yeah, this person's just, this person just wants to bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk. I mean, this person is really good in bed. This person has some moves, like I said. You know, I feel like you can have a good time with this individual. That's if you're looking for that in this right moment here. The Six of Wands ugh, and the Hermit, Virgo energy. Yeah, you know, over time, this person's going to realize that they're developing feelings here. And this person's going to, you know, start distancing, distancing themselves from you. Yeah, they're, they're, fall, they're, distancing, they're distancing themselves from you because they're falling in love with you here. We have the Five of Cups and the Five of Cups again. Wow. Seems like this person didn't really want to go into this with any sort of emotions here, but they're definitely developing emotions. Yeah, the Nine of Cups here. And also we have the Nine of Swords. Yeah, this person's like really stressed out, really anxious here. You know, I feel like this person didn't really intend to fall in love with you, but this person is. Yeah, this person is. Like, perhaps both of you guys went into it. Like, you know, okay, let's like meet, meet, meet up with each other once a week, twice a week, and just, you know, 
bonked each other for five hours and you know over time i feel like you know maybe you guys had like you know you guys were talking story after that and you guys started to connect what else do we have for sagittarius what does the sagittarius need to know look out for work on for october 2024 when it comes to this love connection for sag Okay, so we have the Ten of Swords here and the King of Swords. Okay. All right. Seems like there could be some sort of betrayal here. A betrayal here. Yeah, there's going to be some sort of... Some, so there's going to be hurt feelings here. Yeah, I, I, you know, here's the thing. We have the King to Queen of Swords. This is a true pair, you guys. Um... I don't feel like, let's say if you're falling in love with this individual here too, I don't I don't feel like this person is really going to give you more but sex. That's it. Even though this person has these strong feelings here for you, I, I just feel like this person is just not really ready to act on it yet or just show it. All right. Yeah, we got the four of cups here. Yeah, eventually, you know, if you're falling for this person, eventually you're going to want that emotional attention here. And I don't feel like this person is willing to give it. If anything... I feel like arguments and fights are going to break out in this situation here. With the Five of Wands and the Four of Cups. Yeah, I feel like you're going to realize your worth here too. And I feel like you might drop this person here or end things with this person. What else do we have here for Sagittarius? What else does Sagittarius need to know when it comes to this situation here? We have the Ten of Swords and also the Hierophant here, Taurus Energy. I don't feel like this person can commit. Yeah. Um, I, I, I feel like this person just doesn't really have it in them right now to be loyal. You know, I just feel like this person is, just wants to be a free bird, do whatever they want. You know, uh, we have the King of Swords here. Why is the King of Swords here? And the High, uh, and the high Priestess. Over time, because of the way that they feel, you know, I feel like this person is going to ghost you. Yeah, I feel like this person's going to ghost you here with the Page of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, you know, it's almost like I feel like this person is trying to replace you with somebody else. And it's like, okay, you know, Sagittarius could be easily, easily replaced, you know, and, you know, and I could find someone else to bunk, you know, where there's no feelings and stuff like that. We have the Star card and the Queen of Swords. Eventually, this person's going to realize that you're the one here. Eventually, this person's going to realize that they want to make you an offer here, perhaps. But you might turn your back and walk away from this person here. You know, I do, I do feel like this person's definitely missing out on an opportunity here. Yeah, this person's missing out on an opportunity here with the Five of Wands. Intemperance, again. Sagittarius energy seems like whoever this is you know i do feel like this person definitely ignores signs this person ignores their guys and their angels and their ancestors here because i do feel like their guys and their angels and their ancestors are letting them know you know this is the person for them i, I do feel like this person's gonna end up alone i do feel like this person's gonna end up alone here because i feel like this person's just not really open to connecting with people in that way yeah i feel like every time like not just with you, but like in other instances, when feelings start to develop, to develop, this person just runs away and sabotages it. So, Sagittarius, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.